Randy Lee here. Boy, oh boy, is he looking ready. Then again, of course, you got to be when you're going up against the likes of Tails, Johnny Gat, <coughs> and this guy. Representing the cabinet and representing Double Z. Zavak. Of course, for those of you who remember, those of you who remember the team battle at last year's Golden Ambitions, it starts off with a representative from each team. Two legal guys in the ring. You can tag in anyone at any time. When an individual is pinned or made to submit, they are eliminated and their partner will come in in their place. You basically eliminate a team by eliminating both of its members. Last team standing wins the tag team titles. It's that straightforward. And Zavok, you see right there, runs straight in for Tails. I'm not too sure why, but... Once again, the um, rivalry really between the cabinet and the former brotherhood probably extending a lot longer than most of the other rivalries. But then again, I did also hear about Tails and Mewtwo supposedly being here a few days ago. And, uh, you know, I didn't want to believe this when I was told it, but they found footage of... But Mewtwo had trapped Reptile out down by the um, barricade of the, um, from our perspective, the southwest bar the southwest barrier, and stink-faced him. That is Mewtwo stink-faced Reptile. So. Yeah. I was wondering when I came here yesterday, I was wondering why the place smelled like ass. It was only when the security tape was shown to me that I then figured out, yep, that's probably what it was. And also, I wasn't even aware that Mewtwo particularly liked Mexican food. Bear hug right now by Zavok. And look at this right now. DDT. Ah, oh, a drop kick to the back of the head of Tails. This is it look like, oh my god. That is a torture rack. Nicely done that. You see now. Oh! Nicely pulled there and now. Throws into the outside. At tails. I'm prettier! And Zavok! Not out of it yet. Tails are getting very close. There's a bell shot right to Zavok. And check this out now. Randy Lee up. Uh oh. Oh shit. Choke slam. And now. Nice snap suplex there by Gat. Now check this out. Oh, but Tails from behind. Smart cut. And now there's one for Randy Lee. You got to deliver another one for Gat. 
But Zavok there. Quick to bring a stop to that. Now. Nicely done. And now look at Zavok. Chug slab there and quickly stops that one. And Zavok right now ready with it. Oh wait a minute now, here comes Gat! But Randy Lee stopped again! Oh and Zavok in with a low drop kick. Out goes Zavak. Johnny Gat goes out after him. Look at Tails! Boom! That's how you fly! Oh! Oh, that Gat was gonna hit that Gat drop! Stopped dead in his tracks. Whoa! Nice roll up there, but it won't count on the outside. Drop kick. Into the ring. Zabak right now. See right now, Gat, Lee and Tails. Rolling on the outside and Zabak just waiting on the inside. Now, pull back again and tails down. Going there with shots and finally Zavok flies in and takes out Gat. Finally Zavok gets back into this one. And right now, he is dominating. Tails going to try and bring that to a stop. But takes the suplex. And now, oh man, nice power bomb there. And there's already this um, this feeling right now here on hits. Just a bad taste being left in everyone's mouth right now. A taste that has been put there by Jack Stambridge. We'll be seeing him compete later tonight. He'll be taking on Arbiter one on one. I've got a feel now that Jack is following him recently, dumping Alyssa. I've got to wonder if that's going to trigger more of a rage in the mind of the Arbiter. See now Zavok able to kill that one there because you, a lot of people know that Arbiter and Alyssa are good friends. I mean, in many ways, Alyssa is a really the only individual that could actually calm the Arbiter down. It's, in some senses, she's like a, a carer. But... I don't wonder how Arbiter's going to be feeling right now. Check that out! Nice double team there, Zavok going straight back up from it though! The weight comes down. Oh man, oh! Stopped there and now! Turns his attention back to Gat! Remember this is KO only! So... Goes on until one of these guys gets knocked out. A shot there. Look out! Oh crap. A 
Yoke slab. Towels kick back up again. You see that Zavok, the way he just sat up there. And Tails. Tails looking in trouble. The choke slab again. Tails gets back up from it. And got there wiping everyone out. Only got now. Look at this. Got drop. Got it. And now. There's one for Zavok. Oh, and Tails there taking out Gat. Now. The leg drop there. Oh, and Zavok now also bringing the ring bell in. See now. The bell shots there to Tails and. Oh, look at this. Oh. Shot there. And. Oh, Zavok. The shots there to. Randy Lee that busted him open and again he, even though we didn't get on cover the bell shots to Gat and Gat Gat's out wow Zavok picks up the win but I'm going to say I don't really know what we're going to do for the replay because we didn't really get the KO shots on the camera but bottom line Zavok is victorious. We'll be able to look at the shots on Randy Lee that busted Randy Lee open and then even though it's off camera at this point he grabbed Gat and just landed the KO shots on him with that ring bell. And that was enough to KO him. Alright people, tag action! Here comes uh, Mist Montone. Of course, Miss Montone's change of attitude. Of course, it didn't really surprise a lot of people, but he ended up backstabbing Silver. Of course, Silver and um. Silver and Mist. They will be competing at Golden Ambitions in a bloody splinter match. We're going to be seeing the blood flowing and the wood flying. And I don't want any comments on that. Well, anyway, here is Miss Montone. Or Mist Motone, as it's spelt. Here comes Skywalker! And of course, he's got a pretty big match for Golden Ambitions. A rematch from last year's Golden Ambitions. Of course, as those of you remember, he lost to Sabalba last year. He's now got a chance to... Um, Got a chance to try and get back at Sabalba. Of course, we still don't know what kind of match it will be. We await a decision. Here is Anakin Skywalker. Of course, ever since he turned his back.